Okay. New flying bird. You see the older details? Okay, we turn another stuff. Price $21.99. Canadian, of course. Mm hmm. We go slow. So it could be stopped anytime, any second. Because I have two granddaughters of mine. And they are just hardly waiting for the unboxing, right? Is that right? Yeah. Yeah. We want to open this bird? Yeah, I'm okay. Okay, it says age is seven and up. Okay, scientifically engineered mechanical flight flies up to 50 yards. Ooh, look at here. Okay, okay, okay. Relax, relax. Ooh, you have to be careful not to damage the bird, right? Okay. Yeah, see, bird is still alive. Oh, she wants to fly away. Wait, 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 wait. Whoa, 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 birdie, don't fly away. Can you help me? Ooh. Okay, now you can play with this. You can play with this. And this is not sharp, you can play with this. So we get extra, extra rubber band. And the, the good thing about this, YouTubers, this is really nice because there is no assembly time. Nothing. You can immediately start cranking it. Might be some break. Look at that! Ooh! Record her. <laughs> Did you see the bird? Catch it? Aw, bird. Wings? Tail? Say hi, birdie. Say hi, Birdie. Hi, Poopoo. -poo. <laughs> hi, Poopoo. -poo. Okay, one more time. See, no assembly required. That must be the, the thing when I was a kid. I first saw it. That uh, was like 30 years ago, probably. I'm 46 now, almost 47. See, put the tail down. Of course. Wanna go left? You're gonna go right? You wanna go down? depending on the flight and then you hit here and it starts flopping and it really creates really creates some lift you feel the lift the reason why I bought it because it reminds me of my childhood I like everything but flies crossbow is flying channel is called Ivan Glide and I like this you wanna touch it? Touch it here. Touch your finger here. Whoa! <laughs> and then it glides back. We cannot try it. But that's the reason why I bought it. Because the thing, I bought this. I bought this. It says made in Taiwan, right? Okay, eight and plus, just a second, honey. And that's a twenty-eight ninety-five. Thames and Cosmos, or Thomas or Cosmos, whatever. And it's made in Taiwan, but it's designed in Stuttgart, Germany. I was born in Mannheim, Germany. So that's the same Baden Wittenberg. Pokai uh, nashta direktno na našem hrvatskom or uh, province on English. So, just a second. It must be seeing here. Anyway, I was pissed off because it says test flying area at least 30 meters, about 100 feet long. And you guess what? I thought I didn't re assembly everything correctly. But what happened is I did I assembled everything correctly. And I was amazed with all the products from these guys. I broke it here, but I, I fixed it with a little bit of <coughs> tape. And I used the three rubbers. I try everything. And it looks good. It doesn't look like a real bird like this one. But I was believing so, so much in this kit. 
because it has a bamboo, it, it has a good reputation, but guess what? It didn't live up to its expectations or whatever. I was hoping I messed up with the putting this reversed, whatever, but after checking a couple of times, the uh, same thing over and over again. I didn't want it to lift, didn't want to go up. Right now it's minus 30 outside and I don't want to go jump in the foot or 30 centimeters deep snow. But look at this. Uh oh. <laughs> She's fixing my rings. Yeah, put it back, honey. Yeah, yeah, it doesn't work anyway. Anyway, it comes with the four different wings and it looks really beautiful. Instruction is, is beautiful, like, like always, with, with, with the German stuff. But So, uh, yeah, and it's, it's really good, the theory. All about insect wings, it, it explains everything about, not everything, but flying, it has a, four different wing types. My granddaughter was just uh, rearranging some of them, and I'm not really worried because if it doesn't fly with one wing type, why should it be flying with a different? It's a dragonfly, it has a bat, it has a bird, and it has a, a butterfly. But the thing is, the thing doesn't work. See, here. Cosmos Verlags, Stuttgart, Germany, Cosmos Day. It doesn't work. It doesn't matter how long you go. 40, half, 60, full, 80, full, and then get 40. It works, but that doesn't fly, really. That doesn't fly. This is too heavy and repetition. I don't know what's the problem. Why it stops at the has a nice mechanic and everything, but just I don't know. And if you go even if you go a higher number, I tried so many stuff. Just it's too heavy compared to this one. And it doesn't work. That's why I bought this one. Because I know this one works for sure. But we cannot really unfortunately. Try it out today. See? You can break it and it's gonna flap a little bit faster. I don't know. I think it's a it's a flawed design. You know the answer, if somebody already built this thing, not just built, but uh, tried to fly it successfully, I would like to know the answer, otherwise it looks really nice. So it kind of stops here and then you feel the pressure, you feel like a, like a bow or a crossbow, I think. It doesn't go smoothly, see, just doesn't make any sense. So this flies like a real bird. It's lighter, has the similar geometry, but this is this looks like a bird, right? This one wins. So what's the name of this one again? Original Tim Flying Bird wins over flying ornithopters. He can cool. Instant result, see? Instant result. And it flies. Thank you for watching. Bye bye. Okay, guys, having fun with the wings? Yeah. Good. Say bye bye. Happy New Year. <laughs> okay, thanks for watching. Thanks, my wife, for recording this, and bye bye. Oops. <laughs> God bless.